Hi, TK families. We are, I am introducing a new program. It is called Seesaw, and we're going to use it mainly for exit tickets. Um, we're having, uh, I think it'll be a little bit easier than using our breakout rooms. We'll still use them sometimes, but I love this Seesaw. I'll give you guys a quick little tutorial on how to use it. So basically, I'm going to send you a letter. You just have to uh, sign up, just kind of like add the app to your phone or to your desktop, and you'll be able to click in easily um, just by adding the codes. I'm going to give you links like in our Neuro chat and give you a code, and it'll just go to, and you'll see a screen like this. And the first thing I'm going to have you do, it's called Seesaw Tools Introduction. So it's this right here, Seesaw Tools Introduction. You will want to click on this add response button. So this green add response button, and you're going to be introduced to just the tools this time. So we're not going to really be doing any math or language arts right now. We're just going to get used to the tools. So after you click add response, you will, you'll be prompted to this window. It will actually be blank. You can listen to, there's a little video here of a little puppet. We'll give the kids directions. Basically, you just want to uh, use the pens down here to write your name. And then they have all these beautiful colors. You can see I kind of, you, different sizes. You can just do any little thing you want. Just real quick, have the kids write their name, get used to those pencil tools, that's all. And then the next slide you'll see over here is number two. And I click on their slides on the side here, on the right hand side, click on two. And this one, the little puppet will tell you to make a design using the tool. So all I did was I clicked on these three dots here and I did some fun shapes. Uh, you can, whatever you wanna do, you can do with thought bubbles, uh, you can make a house, whatever you want to do. Um, just a little design, just so they can play around with the shapes and they can play more with the pencils if they wanna change colors. Um, it's pretty fun. The next slide is number three, so it's on the right-hand side. Uh, it will say, roll the dice and erase each feature using this tool. So there's a little link here, it's called the random dice. You'll click on that link, it's pretty fun. And uh, it'll pop up here and you'll see the dice. Ah, three, so three is what, I have to erase the smile. So I'll go to my little eraser tool, click on the eraser tool and I will just erase his smile. You can do it as many times as you want. Go back to that dice, click it again. It rolls six. Oh, I have to erase his glasses. Ooh, that could be a little trickier. So grab your eraser again and just start erasing his little glasses. So it just kind of gets them used to the tools, how to use the eraser tool. Um, and also you can see links. The little puppet down below will tell you all the instructions too. All right, the fourth thing that we're gonna do is the typing tool. Now this is more for you, but sometimes uh, they'll be typing sight words, maybe they'll type their name. So you just click this big T, just kind of like our tools, click on it and a little box will happen and you can type in their name for them and move it around if you want. Um, so that's how you use the typing tool. You can change colors if you want also. Uh, the next tool that we're gonna introduce you to is really fun. I'm gonna use this one a lot. It's the recording tool. So you see the little, the puppet will again give you instructions, but you, you click on that little microphone. So over here, I'm gonna click on the microphone and I'm gonna record my voice. And I'm just gonna record, what do I see on this picture? And I've already kind of done that. Uh, and so I'll, I'll show you and just kind of maybe I talk about the zoo animals or I see a, a zebra and a panda and they're both black and white. It doesn't have to be long, but just so they can play around with the microphone tool. So right there, it's kind of a fun tool. You start your recording, very easy, very fun. The next tool that again is fun. I'm gonna click down here on the last slide and it says, let's do the picture tool. So I'm gonna click on the picture and I'll take a photo. So right here's the photo. You can also do videos, and I want you to do one video. So take two cute pictures, silly pictures, and then do a fun video. I might use this so when they're reading their letters, maybe they're going to read books to me. Um, it's really fun for them to record. So anyways, I'm so excited about Seesaw, and at the very end, you just click that green check or the green circle with the 